shut my window so now of course there's going to be a helicopter come through I like I detest this apartment and cities so much I can't like I I'm so close to going to live in a country again somewhere like 20 minutes away from the city I can't do it anymore I'm just I need peace I need like I need quiet I can't do it anymore I'll be right back okay we're back so as you can see I shaved my head <laughs> feeling very inspired. I don't know. I wanted to start fresh. But then I realized how much I like it, so I'm probably going to keep it. Although, I did realize that my head is shaped very weird. personality 
can get crazy, but I am very calm. And I think I'm going to utilize that um, and really stick to ASMR videos because I do love them. And I feel like there's not any drama, really. All the comments are usually really amazing, and um, it's just, they're all really good, like, communities, and it's less, it's social media, but it's, like, not social media. I feel like ASMR is a whole other world, and it's just good vibes all around, so. Where was I going?
just, it really feels like nobody understands what I'm trying to portray in that I am very deeply, deeply distressed with the fact that I am a man with breast implants and I've become agoraphobic and I have to leave to go to the office twice a week. I work hybrid. So those days I can manage, but I've also gained a lot of weight from the depression and None of my clothes fit. I don't. I don't have a lot of clothes because I'm not really someone. I don't really like want to buy a lot of clothes and have a lot of options because I'm like very simple with clothing. But now it's gotten to a point where I tried to go like thrifting for new clothes, but I it was it was so distressing, and I've just I've gained so much weight and I can't wear any shirts without it looking awful. Um, so just like the distress that that's causing me, it, it is giving me psychosis where I'm like, I'm switching in between like realities and like what I want for myself and who I am. And honestly, I know I'm going to come out of this very, very, very strong because level-headed and like calm through all of it is like next level um but that's kind of where I'm at right now and over the past two months um I've really been going through the thick of it with all of that and just like I'm unhappy with my where I live and just like the trajectory of my life so it was hard um I wasn't, I wasn't present in my body at all, so, um, even, like, the joy that I was getting from making ASMR videos, it, I just, I did not even think about ASMR outside of watching it to, like, calm down because I was getting really bad anxiety, and then with that, I would binge eat because it's the only thing that would calm my anxiety, but then I'd wake up with anxiety because I was binge eating very late, and it's this vicious cycle, um, but yeah, don't know if that part is worth sharing. Um, I bounced back and forth. Um, I, I have borderline and I was, I would always bounce between, um, like identities as a, as a way to like prevent myself from feeling emotions. By doing, <laughs> by doing that, I was giving myself stress. So, anyway, I'm at the point now where I stopped and that was in February and after that, the clinic that I was going to were like, wow, we don't see trans people, so out you go. And um, I, I honestly, I'm, I want to keep my ASMR pretty like light spirited um, and I don't want to get it, make it too, like, depressing. So. I feel like I was on something there, but. I don't know. Anyway. So, yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. And I feel like there's definitely improvements happening. So, it's likely that. Basically, like two weeks away from the five month, and they said um, 
it was going to be like five or six months wait for the referral or for the consultation so likely by October next month or November um, I'll have the consultation which will be a game changer just in everything and um cause like with gaining weight I know I, I'm going to go back to the gym and like start exercising and stuff but I have no motivation to like go outside and I don't want to be perceived and like <clears throat> I need to I know all of that will change once I get the implants removed so it's really just getting through that period but yeah um, yeah so that's where I've been and that's kind of a grasp on who I am my new manager, she was saying that I bring like a calm presence to, to our team, so, and then I was like, I get told that a lot, and I feel like even when my past position with the company was customer service, so even when I was dealing with customers, it was like, they would all say, not all of them, because some people are wild, but most of them would say that I have like a very calm energy, and that I feel like say the bird is fine because birds say what they're calling because it's nature not cars and fucking people stopping <laughs> also I'm so used to having to like the other microphone having to hold it like this but there's so much space with this one
So bear with me. <laughs> 